Hi, I'm NASA Kennedy's Malcolm Boston, and I'm taking you inside KSC. A mission that's been in the making for 60 years has finally begun. NASA's Parker Solar Probe lifted off from Cape Canaveral Air Force Station's Space Launch Complex 37 at 3.31 a.m. on Sunday, August 12th. It was the start of a landmark study of the star of our solar system, the Sun. The size of a small car, the spacecraft was sent on its long journey by a United Launch Alliance Delta IV heavy rocket. The Parker Solar Probe is the fourth of six missions this year for NASA's Launch Services Program based here at Kennedy. The mission was first proposed in 1958 by Dr. Eugene Parker, a pioneer in heliophysics, the study of the sun. After anticipating the launch, the University of Chicago professor is looking forward to seeing his vision becoming a reality. Well, I really have to turn from biting my nails and getting it launched to thinking about all the interesting things which I don't know yet. Uh, and which will be made clear, I assume, over the next five or six or seven years. Uh, it's a whole new phase and it's gonna be fascinating. With technology now in place for a mission to fly into the sun's atmosphere, the spacecraft's findings will help researchers improve their understanding of phenomena such as the solar wind. The spacecraft will transmit its first science observations in December beginning a revolution in our understanding of the star that makes life on Earth possible. And remember, Spaceport Magazine digs deeper inside KSC.